Oh shit, I can't even shoot. No, excuse me. Sorry. Shit. Shit. Oh shit, this sucks. Alright, right here, right here. Come on, come on! How come I can't shoot straight? Oh shit. Thank you. Alright, we should be good. I think I liked you better when you was all trussed up like a prize chicken. No doubt. Oh, hurry up. They're going to be on our tails soon enough if you boys keep wasting time. Oh, that's us told them. Ugh. Hey, Arthur. Thank you. You're Don't welcome. Let's go. All right, let's go indeed. Quick before the law gets wind of this. So what the hell happened in San Denis? Is Abigail all right? She's fine. Jack is too. She managed to escape when they got Hosea. Hosea. That still don't seem real somehow. I know. All them years. Arthur. He was like like family. I know. Uh, we lost young Lenny too. No. Yeah. What a goddamn mess. That's what I said. We... What about the the money? Lost what money? At the bottom of the ocean. What? How the hell did that happen? We hit on a boat. It's the only way out of there. The boat went down in a storm, and we ended up stranded on an island somewhere near Cuba. Cuba. Yep. Wait. You're gonna have to tell me all this again. It's a long story, but things ain't been good, John. <laughs> You're telling me. We're holed up now in the mountains to the north, near Rono Grist, and some caves there. The Pinkertons caught up with us again, and we had to move. Yeah, seems Molly ratted us out, the bitch. So she's dead too. Jesus. Maybe you should have just left me to hang. And uh, I should warn you, Dutch didn't want us breaking you out. Said it wasn't the right time, so might not be the hero's welcome you're imagining. So much for no man left behind. Yeah, I know, I, I agree. Thinking about this. In the bank, when they grabbed me, he saw it. Felt almost like he had a a moment to do something and didn't. The Dutch ain't himself right now. Or maybe he just ain't who we thought he was. Now you, you know what we're saying. Worry about who's his favorite no more. <laughs> Guess not. Wow, Dutch didn't even want to help bring Marston back. That says a lot. And I'm glad Arthur is finally noticing how much of a piece of shit Dutch is. Between him and Micah, I just can't stand the two. Here we are. Guess who finally came home? You brought him back to me. We told you we would. John! What are you doing here? Are you dead ass? Good to see you too, partner. I meant I hadn't sent for you yet. I will. But I said that. Yeah, I know what you said. I felt different. Is that so? Yes. You got a problem with that? And if so, yes. why? And when Spring and John brings the law down on all of us, what then, Arthur? Well, I guess we'll have another fight on our hands. Since you're so used to doing that yourself, Dutch. Arthur, it ain't. I had a goddamn plan! John. John. You are my brother. You are my son. Funny way I of saying that. For you. No, you I, weren't. They was talking of hanging me, Dutch. They was talking. They was talking. 
And now they may come and hang us all. Seems like only Dutch is worrying about himself low-key. He's not worrying about the group, he's worrying about himself. Worrying about how he's gonna save himself. My prediction is, somehow, one way or the other, he's gonna abandon us to fend for himself. Can't stand him. And Arthur's dying. Arthur? Yeah. Arthur. Mm. Oh, sorry. I was miles away, thinking of, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Dutch said to tell you he and Mike have gone to Annisburg. Okay. Something about Mr. Cornwall. Cornwall. Okay. Thanks, Mary Beth. I like how he didn't bother to tell me. He had someone else to tell me for me. So petty. So petty. Yeah, what's up? Thank you. Thank you so much. Anytime. We ain't done yet, Abigail. Dutch seems to have lost his mind. I know. You know it's that too, right? Just be careful. I don't have to be careful. I, I have you as a friend. No, thanks. I appreciate that. I really do. <laughs> what? What's going on? Okay, I'm here. Where you at? Ooh, okay. All right, hold still. Hold still. Aim weapon. Right here. Hey, are you okay? Here. Go ahead, so take it. Um, I got some uh, medicine. Medicina. See. Si. What do you want? Hey. Hey, stay with me. Oh, <gasps> oh, he's dead. Oh, he's dead. Okay, well, I'll take my medicine back. Yeah, I got biscuits, rabbit, pellet. Yeah. I'm sorry. I guess medicine did not work. Kind of sucks. And look, his horse, right? So I guess the boar must have attacked the horse. Horse fell, instantly dead. And since the guy fell off the horse, the boar went after him too. I mean, I shot the little piggy, but I don't I don't even know where the little boar went. Damn, I feel bad though. I'm not going to lie. I thought the medicine would have helped. So, what? Micah is somewhere in this area? I'm surprised he's not in the sheriff's office. What the heck? No, no. Was you followed? I said no. Weirdo. <laughs> what is your problem? What is your problem, partner? Are you no, drunk? Uh, you don't look so good. What is wrong with you? Nothing wrong with me. I'm fit as a fiddle. And I inside you ain't. I'm just a realist, friend. Micah reckons there's a rat. Oh, does he? On what evidence? He's only back a minute. Pinkerton show up. <laughs> We've been on the run since you two fools went crazy in Blackwater. We barely escaped with our lives in San Denis. Now we got a rat. Well, Molly clearly talked, but who else? Maybe we pushed things too hard. Uh, Maybe time for folks like us has passed. We don't need a rat. We got sloppier than the town drunk. And they know who we are and where we are. He has a point, Dutch. Thing we can do is let the week go. Move on, get our money, and start over. That ain't happening. Well, something's gotta happen, and fast. Otherwise, Cornwall, them Pinkertons, they've got us penned in here. And ain't none of them stopping. Well, Cornwall's why we're here. Shall we, Dutch? Yeah, it's time to go. Let's head to the river. Oh, leave Cornwall alone. He ain't... 
We need money. But revenge? Now? Of course it's for money. Come on, Arthur. This better not be no stupid revenge mission, Dutch. It ain't worth it. Don't be ridiculous. Oh, Arthur. It's just a simple social call. <laughs> you know Dutch is lying, and you know for a fact it's a stupid revenge mission, and you know for a fact these two dumbheads here so are gonna ruin it for everyone. To that needs to be said. He has been hunting us since Valentine. He is the reason that Hosea got killed. His sugar business is destroying the people of Guarma. This town, Arthur, it's his town. He bought it just to destroy these folks. His sugar, his oil, his law. These are wrongs that you can't wrap, Dutch. We're wanted men. Hmm. So why did you go for John against my wishes? I didn't want him hanged. Unlike you. Well, you have a funny way of showing it, Dutch. What are you talking about? We want out. And Cornwall wants us to stop robbing him, and we all know his money is what's keeping the Pinkertons on our tail. He's America, Arthur. And I want out. And he... he won't let us go. This ain't making a lot of sense, Dutch. It will, son. It will. Son. A son. Deal, some noise, and then we're gone. I can tell this water is filthy. Look how brown it is. Reminds me of Waterbury. And number two, Dutch is being so indirect with his plan. Really? So we're we're gonna shoot him? Is that it? Man, this is horrible. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Will you get out of sight? I am Dutch. Arthur, get behind something before you're spotted. I am behind something, Dutch. I want to thank you for your hospitality, Mr. Cornwall. This was a business meeting, Mr. Milton. We are not friends. I have spent a considerable fortune with your agency and still nothing. This Vanderlyn robs me and laughs at me. I asked for the best. I paid for the best. We are very close, Mr. Cornwall. I know you've heard this before. Can't, sir. Send a telegram to Goldberg in New York. Tell him I won't borrow it more than 3.2%. Sorry, no, I have heard it before. And get that army man to pay his portage charge. Yes, sir. We are doing all we can within the confines of the law. The law? I think we both know what you can do with your law. Find me Dutch Vanderlyn. Bring him here and leave the laws to them as need them. Good day, sir. Oh, yeah, he's pissed. Mr. Didsbury. Mr. Cornwall. Now listen up, Didsbury. What's all this about strikes? I bought into this mine because of mismanagement. And I intend to make it a success no matter what the cost. It's the wages. Folk feel Folk that you... feel? Business doesn't give two figs about feelings, sir. Not two figs. It's a nonsense that will bring a plague on both our houses, sir. Perhaps there is a plague on your house already, Mr. Cornwall. What Dutch, what the heck? Sir? I'm not quite sure just yet. Your impudence will be your undoing, sir. I'm undone already. Even my best friend here, he thinks I'm crazy. And like this poor fellow you are talking to, my feelings are hurt. You robbed me, sir. And you robbed him. Funny world. You show a criminal's grasp of sophistry, sir. I did no such thing. You kill. I kill. You rob. I rob. Only difference I can see is I choose whom I kill and rob and you destroy everything in your path. I've heard just about enough. I'll tell you what. You give me this ship, $10,000, and safe passage out of here, I'll let you live. <laughs> I'll do no such thing! <laughs> you sure? Good. I prefer it this way. Wow! Dutch is crazy! <laughs> Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. Crazy. Crazy. And the Pickertons just left, too. Pinkertons. 
Yeah, I'm surprised. I'm surprised. Actually, I'm not surprised. Screw that. I'm not even surprised, honestly. Of course the Pinkertons are here. They haven't even fully left the area yet, Dutch. Dumbass. Okay. Okay, Dutch, let's go. Yeehaw. That's all I have to say. Yeehaw. Next. And there's one up there, right? Got you. Ooh. I got shot. Hold on. Let me go and get a bite. So I can... Um... Get all my... My... Health and my... Abilities back. Yeah, I bet. Hold on. Here you go. Hold on. Boom. Got one. Got one. Where? Oh, okay. Got it. Right here. Boom. Come on. Come on. Ooh. Oh, I shot Micah. Okay. All right, let's go. Come on, come on. I got it. I'm following Dutch. Uh-huh. You know I'm sick, right? You know I'm dying, right? I can only do so much. Yeah, I bet. Okay. All right. This is crazy. This is crazy. Right here. Yep. We're going to definitely be wanted men. Okay. How he know? How he know I got TV? Making all TV jokes. Stupid Micah. Bye. I can't believe this. It is. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. I am so done. This is so stupid. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm here, I'm here. What are we doing? Oh, how convenient, Micah. Shut up. Man, I'm over here getting shot at. This is horrible. Horrible. Of course there's more. Uh-huh. The oil wagon. Hold on. Hold on. Ooh. Well, hold on, hold on. Sorry. I got this. There you go. That eliminates some people. Yeah? Oh, we got a whole bunch. Okay. He's gone. Okay. Tried? That's cute. Alright, say less, Dutch. This is not the type of cowboy adventures I like doing. I mean, I don't mind throwing the whole Robin Hood thing, but this is just distasteful in general. Dutch, they're coming this way. Yeah, I'm not surprised. All right, got it. Come on. Oh, I got one. I got a stray bullet. Okay. 
Say less. Another one. Boom, got one. Oh, I know they are. They're not gonna stop until we kill all of them. Man, this is crazy. There you go, got one. All right, I got one. We actually did it? We actually got away? What? Interesting social call. No, oh, don't play dumb and superior at the same time, Morgan. Shut up, Micah. No, Sooner or later, Cornwall had to go. Let me see them papers. It's more attention we don't need. Feels like the whole world's closing in on us. Dutch, it won't be long before they find where we're hiding out now. Especially, Especially if what we did. Exactly hiding now. We just need a distraction. Buy us some time. It looks like Mr. Cornwall's company has signed a railroad contract with the army. And they're also moving dynamite down from, well, the Annisburg mines to San Denis to resell. And there's bonds at his oil factory. Maybe there's a way to get them off our back and get the money that we need. Mike, are you serious? Dynamite, take Bill, I guess, Arthur. You go too. We are going to need a lot of it. And Mike, we need to talk. Figure out some things. Of course, boss. Figure out what? The plan. Getting out of here. Nothing's changed. It hasn't, huh? There's an old house west of Van Horn. Meet me there when you can, Black Lung. Let's Shut up, up, Micah. We'll meet up back at camp. Yeah. This is crazy. Here. Sir, are you okay? Hey, friend. Are you okay? What's going on? Why are you in the river? I just don't want him to see me. We're not friends anymore. We're not. Okay. They won't forgive you. Uh -uh. They, they, they didn't forgive me. There is no forgiveness. None, friend. None. What are you talking about? I, I know you want it. it what? Can, I can smell it on you. Are you on drugs? Well, it ain't happening. No, 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 it isn't. <laughs> that's why, that, that, that's why uh, I'm out here, well away from them. See, they come for me, but I'm watching. <laughs> I never sleep. I never do. Are you okay? Preacher. Are you okay? What type of... What are you on? This is where you live? This is where you sleep? Hold on, let me let me get a closer look at this guy. Wow, this is insane. He's dirty, he's skinny, malnourished. I'm sorry, let me let me uh stand back. My bad, I'll leave you alone. Reverend? You okay, Mr. Morgan? No. I don't know, Reverend. These are challenging times for all of us. Yes, very challenging. You don't seem yourself somehow. I, I've always felt... I've left the morphine, sir. Arthur, I'm in Reverend Swanson, would you excuse us a minute? Oh, oh great. Oh, great. What, what do you want, Dutch? New York, 
We are gonna go to New York. Now, they have been chasing us south and east and west. We're gonna get a boat, we're gonna get on a river, and we're gonna go north. New York. Then Tahiti, the Fiji Islands, or this place, New Guinea, dancing girls, freedom. But first, we have to make a whole lot of smoke, a whole lot of commotion. And then really? We disappear. We need more commotion. One score and one whole hell of a lot of noise. We ain't so good at doing scores anymore, Dutch. Are you feeling all right, Arthur? No, clearly so, I'm not. Uh, pardon me for interrupting. What is this constant interruption? First, right, Dutch, now this. Hello, hello, Dutch. This is Eagle Flash. His father is a great chief. Charles and I, we uh, pretended to be mercenaries. He did me a great favor. Dutch Vanderlyn. How do you do? Not well, sir. Well, I am sorry to hear that. How's your father? Father is confused. Wisdom with weakness. What's going on? His people, my people. We've suffered too much. Been lied to too much. Now they've taken our horses. Who? Who? The infantry division posted at Fort Wallace. Why? Colonel Favors is a liar and a murderer. His people won't stop until we're all dead. Without horses, we cannot hunt. Without hunting, we will starve. Wow, this that's horrible. I see that. Men have helped me before, and I have money. Put your money away, son. What do you think, Charles? You know I told your father I will not fight over some horses. But I made no such promise. Dutch. Come along. Damn, Dutch. Arthur, we must go with them. And try to stop things from getting... Crazy, okay. right? I guess. Oh, my God. <sighs> Dutch is such a hothead, man. Of course he wants to put himself into other people's business. I know. I understand Eagle Flies is angry, but I don't see how this will help anything. Especially not with Dutch whipping him up into a frenzy. Yeah, he's an instigator. Coming after us without adding an army to the list. You going to let these bastards walk all over you? No, you're not. This is all that's wrong with this world. Dutch. Listen, there's a concept called choosing your batter battles, and this ain't it, Dutch. I don't know what you're trying to prove, but this ain't it. Okay, young man, lead the way. The horses are on a boat near Van Horn. I have a man waiting for us there with some canoes. Surely this can be done without killing anyone. Of course. What will be, will be. Anyone Shut up, son, Dutch. Tell me about this Colonel Favors. He's a vile man. He and his regiment take pleasure in persecuting us. All the young have been taken from our reservation, shipped off to reform schools. Many women, too. The old are weak and sick, but they deliberately withhold medicine and supplies from us. This ends today. You have my word on that. Dutch, what the hell are you able to do? He has such a savior complex, it's annoying. Yeah, for a price, right? Yeah. It's been quite a while since we helped anyone but ourselves, and even you know that. I told you, noise. We need noise, Arthur. Wow, I knew it. I still don't know what that means. He wants a distraction, and this is it. And think, just think for a second. The Pinkertons have had time to reinforce the civilized closing on us who knows what else molly told them we need to move towards a conclusion now sure but what's this gotta do with any of that some good honest conflict between the army and the indians might be just the distraction we need i know it bingo birds with one stone cornwall was funding the pinkerton's assault on us why do you think i dealt with them Cornwall gone. The government is far more likely to divert them to other issues, especially if there's one more scandal. And then we can slip away. Like I said, we just need that noise and one more score. You're pathetic, so Dutch. I went back for the chest I had hidden outside Shady Bell, and we're close 
tortured, that dynamite, the railroad contract with the army, it was all in those papers Micah found. I have a plan. You just have to trust me. Whatever, Dutch. Your plans have always messed us up. I don't see what's the difference with this one. It's pathetic if you ask me. There's Peta. These men, like I said, they'll help us. I got the canoes. The boat is still moored in the channel. Good. Let's wait until nightfall. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.